languages. For those whose language is gift-giving, the joy comes from the thought and effort behind the present. Even the smallest token is a tangible reminder that someone appreciates them. Those with quality time as their primary love language thrive or time spent alone with their partner. This could mean an elaborate date night or a simple night. The main thing is that it's time spent truly in each other's company. When the language that speaks to you is words of affirmation, you like verbal confirmations of love. It's not just saying, I love you. It's also being told that the work you do is appreciated or that you make someone proud to be by your side. Do you feel loved when someone cooks you dinner after a long day, particularly when it's unasked? Well, if that's the case, you may well have acts of service as your primary love language. If physical touch is your primary language, then back rubs, snuggling in front of the TV, holding hands in public is definitely your thing. What about you, mate? What's your love language? Let me know and comment below.